Hi guys, welcome back to High Yield Interview Trading. So today the strategy that I want to discuss includes an indicator called as triple EMA, that is triple exponential moving average. Okay, now this is something that came up uh, from one of my Discord channel members named Onkar. He introduced this to me. I did some back testings with the value that fits in best and what other indicators or oscillators can be used along with it and uh, finally came up with this strategy. Okay, so uh, thanks Onkar for having this introduced to me and now I'm sure this is gonna help many other guys out there. All right. Also, I have a new announcement to make, which I'm going to say at the end of the video. So first thing first, let's jump on to the strategy. All right. So before I go ahead and show you the strategy and how it works, let me give you a brief about Tema. So Tema is a single line configuration. When I say single line configuration, what I mean is it will uh, be shown with just a single line on the charts. Okay. So normally it smoothens the price for almost three times using the EMA formula. There's an EMA formula which is being used uh, for this. And the thing to note here is that Tema reduces the lag to a greater extent unlike the other moving averages. Okay. Now coming to the characteristics of Tema. Tema works only on strong trending markets. Okay. Conversely, Tema is not good to use when the market is ranging. That is when the market is range bound or when the market is flat or when the market is moving sideways. Okay. So have this in mind. Uh, don't use it in such market conditions because it will surely generate many false or fake signals. Okay. Now coming on how to use Tema. So when the price breaks Tema in the upward direction, that is when the candlestick closes above Tema, we can go long. And when the price breaks Tema in the downward direction, that is when the candlestick closes below Tema, we can go short. Okay. Also, we need to use super trend with the value of 10 and 3. Super trend will help us in deciding whether we should enter the trade or not. And the second oscillator is ADX. ADX uh, will help us to know the strength of the movement. Okay, because as I said, Tema works only on strongly trending markets. So ADX is important here. Okay, now moving on to the charts, let me show you how to plot Tema on Kite. Okay, now I have chosen a couple of stocks that were strongly trending last Friday. So let's see how we can use Tema over there. So moving on to the charts here. Okay. This is ITC guys. So I assume that you know how to draw uh, or plot super trend with the value 10 and 3, which is already plotted here. ADX with the default values. Okay. Now in order to plot Tema, you need to go to studies. You need to go to moving average. Change the value to 30. The default value is 50. I did some experimentations and did some research and finally concluded that 30 is a good number to use here field will be close and the type you go to the drop down and click on triple exponential okay and you click on done so the red line that you see here is tema okay i will take you to trading view because the view is much better there okay so this is uh, uh this is trading view guys and we have the itc chart open here okay so Okay, now start of the day Friday. We are not trading at this range because uh, super trend is not uh, giving us a buy signal here. Okay, nothing is clear as of now. Okay, so we are not trading from 9.15 to 9.55. Okay, at 10 o'clock, we got a signal uh, from super trend to go long. Okay, also the candle close, uh, closes above the Tema line and the ADX is also giving us a strong signal wherein the green line is above the red line and the green line that is the plus DI line and the ADX line are moving diagonally upwards. Okay, so this will be a good time to enter. Okay, we enter here, we stay in the trade till here. Okay, we get off at this point when this red candle is formed and it closes below the Tema line. Okay, so a trade from uh, 314 to let's say 318, 4 rupees move for a 300 rupees stock is more than sufficient for a day trader. Okay, so this is one trade that we make in ITC. Okay, 
After that, if you see here, it is almost a flat movement. It's almost a sideways movement. So we are not doing anything here. But the guys who really like Super Trend and religiously follow it, they can surely stay in the trade. If I have been you, I would have stayed in the trade. Having the stop loss just below the super trend. Okay, let's say for example, if the super uh, if the super trend is lying at 316, I will have my stop loss at 315.75 or 315.85 maybe. Okay, so if you stay here, after a couple of hours, you see another green candle which is closing above the Tema line. If you don't want to enter here, you can wait for another candlestick to form. The second candle is also closing above the Tema line. We get a green signal from Supertrend. We get a green signal from ADX as well. So we enter here and see what happens. It zooms. Okay. Now you can be on uh, in the trade till this point. Okay. Or you can come out at this point when we have this red candle formed and it's just about to close below the Tema line. Okay. Again, a good amount of profit here. Okay. So this was ITC guys. Now moving on to Sun Pharma. Okay, now for Sun Pharma, we got a green signal right from the first candle of the day. Okay, so the first candle of the day, it's closing above the Tema line. But if you want to wait, let's wait. And the second candle also closes above the Tema line. The super trend is supporting. The ADX is also supporting. So we get in here. Okay, we get in here. We stay in the trade till here. Okay, th till this point. Because this is a small candle which closes below the Tema line. Okay. If I have been you, I will stay in this trade because Supertrend is still giving me the signals to stay back. ADX is also giving me a signal to stay back. But for safe place or the guys who are new, they can surely get off here. Okay. So a profit for, uh, right from 342. Dot, let's say, um, sorry, 543. Let's say, let's round it up. 543 to... 553 okay it's a 10 rupees move guys for a 500 rupees stock okay so it's a good amount of profit that we can have here okay next moving on to titan same way we are not trading here in this range because super trend is not giving us a signal to go long we wait we get a signal from super trend at this at this candle okay and also the candle is closing above the tema line so we can enter here okay and we can stay back now this uh, scenario is a bit different because uh, once we enter here we again get a red candle which is closing below the Tema line okay now in such scenarios what we can do is we can take the help of super trend and ADX to confirm whether we should stay back in the trade or not if I have a new I will surely stay back in this trade because very clearly super trend is giving me a signal to stay back and ADX is also giving me a good strength to stay back okay a good strength for the stock to stay back so I stay back and after a couple of hours it goes up then sideways for a moment then finally we get a candle which closes above the Tema line super trend is also supporting ADX is also supporting and see what happens it zooms okay it zooms and the good point is we can stay in the trade throughout the day till the end of the market because we have not got a candle which closes below the Tema line. Okay, so this was Titan, guys. Lastly, it is Havels. This is the same scenario which I discussed earlier. <coughs> we are not trading in this range we, uh, because the super trend is not giving us a signal to go long. Okay, we enter here. Okay, when there's a crossover of ADX and uh, we have the candle closing above the Tema line, also we have Super Trend supporting us. Okay, now I took this trade knowingly, I do, took this example knowingly because let's say, for example, you enter at this point, okay, 549.60. Okay, you stay in the trade, uh, it went uh, till here. You did not book your profits. You did not lock your profits and suddenly it falls down. Okay. Now the point where you get off the trade is here in this candlestick wherein the candlestick is closing below the Tema line. Okay. Now even in this type of scenario, either you will come out cost to cost 
or you will get a small profit and come out okay as I always say a profit is a profit no matter whether it is small or big a profit is always a profit so in this case right from 449.60 to 451.83 almost a 2 rupees gain for a 450 rupees stock is good enough for a day trader again okay now post this it was almost a flat market in this range so if you uh, if you are following the super trend religiously you can stay back uh, in the trade okay and uh, you can have your stop loss as I mentioned earlier just below uh, maybe uh, 20 25 or 30 paise just below the super trend line okay and uh, see what happens after that we get a green uh, we get a candle which closes above the tema line and then again it zooms okay and we can stay in this trade till the end of the market because we have not got any candlesticks which uh, are closing below the tema line okay so this is as simple as it is guys but uh, one thing to remember in fact two things to remember is tema works absolutely beautifully in strongly trending markets that is the first point and the second point is stick to your primary strategy and use the tema strategy just to be sure about the moves okay i'm very sure you will get nice moves okay in either direction all right so this is what i wanted to discuss here guys so mm, just a moment all right so yeah yeah um, that is what uh, the whole strategy is uh, all about and I'll, uh, as always uh, would insist you all to backtest this first and then apply it in the live market i'm sure you will get a big deal of surety from this for all your trades okay now coming on to the announcement so it's about the new telegram channel that me and my team are coming up with intent is to provide just another platform having the same calls as in our discord channel okay maybe a few extra calls over there in the telegram channel as that will be managed by my team and i will just make sure that the calls in discord and telegram are in sync okay now this request actually came from many of you guys uh, seems like many of the guys out there use telegram and whatsapp and are comfortable using it so we thought uh, why not give it a try all right so uh, have a look at the end of the video to know uh, the details about the telegram channel all right so as always we request you all to like subscribe and look forward for my next video and yeah guys just want to take 30 seconds of yours to remind you about my training program commencing on 22nd july 2017 and i'm getting tremendous response for the slot reservations so I request you all to book your slots right away as it is on a first come first service basis uh, please visit www.highyieldtradings.com forward slash trainings to get the details about the training program thanks much and guys these are the options which you have to get in touch with me or with my team directly uh, first one is the website you can visit the website uh, wherein you can register for the trainings directly and we have also introduced a new page called trade gallery uh, wherein I post all the calls or uh, the analysis of the calls that I give for the day so you can have a look and you can very well understand why the call was given what was the entry and what's the exit uh, second one is the Facebook page uh, you can visit the Facebook page uh, like it comment on it and you can also ask any queries that you might be having third one would be the whatsapp number this is the direct number for my team so uh, once you get in touch with us we'll make sure that we revert back to you and the last one is telegram you can um, join the telegram channel to uh, watch out all the, all the calls that we uh, give over there so basically discord and telegram will be in sync all right thank you so much